Hi guys, it's Dan here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to add an individual listing on Best Company's website. So the first thing you want to do is actually go to the top right here and press add a listing. And it'll actually give the option there of actually adding a company listing or an individual listing. Now for more information about adding a company listing, if that's something you're interested in, please check out this video here. But for today's example, we're going to be showing you how to insert an individual listing. So what you want to do is click insert individual listing. So then going to take you through to this page and step one of seven is just adding in your full name. So for this example, I've just entered in my full name, Dan Grant, and then I'm going to press next. Once that's done, it'll actually take you through to the section, tell us more about yourself. So for this section, all you really want to do is exactly what it says on the tin, just a very short kind of description of what you're like, you know, what you enjoy, your hobbies, all that kind of stuff, and just add it in into this small paragraph. So I'll just add that in now. As you can see, I've just added in my example there. Uh, obviously, it's nothing too special, and maybe if you were doing that, you'd be a bit more detailed. But uh, there's the example for that one, and we'll just hit next there. So for this section, it's just going to ask who you are. So, uh, you know, maybe allude to your profession on this one, but keep it personal. Uh, don't go into too much detail about your profession, as the next step is actually more about that. So obviously, make it quite uh, short and sweet and something attention-grabbing too. So uh, I'll just add in my example now. So there you go, something short and sweet. Um, obviously make sure to keep these third person as well. So for example, as opposed to saying I work, etc., you can say your name and then works within a small company, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, once that's done, just press next. And uh, this one, as you can see, is more business related, as I said. So, uh, so you know more about the services that you offer or the services that your company offers, all that kind of stuff. Uh, so I'll add in my example and show you what I'd write for this one. So you know, there's just a quick example of someone that works in digital marketing, but obviously if you're a plumber, you'd go into more detail about that. Depending on your niche, just basically say what your company does and the services that they provide throughout the United Kingdom. Once that's done, just press next and you're on to step five. So step five is actually about your specific role within that company. So again, if you are working within a larger agency, so say for example, a used car salesman, you'd explain how you specifically sell cars as opposed to what the company does, you know, selling cars. Uh, so more in detail about your actual services that you provide as opposed to the company. So again, I'll just pop in my example and I'll run you through that again. So again, I've alluded to the fact that I'm working for a marketing company, however, I've gone into detail about my actual role at that company. Now for yourself, you just want to be as specific as possible within your actual role, and again, to make sure that you're actually talking in third person as well. Once that's done, just move on to step six. And this step is actually what entrepreneurial status you are. So if you haven't checked it out yet, just check out this fatrank.com slash entrepreneur link down here. And what that actually is, is it's going to explain all the different entrepreneurial types that you can be within your company. So for example, I've had a look through here and I found that an entrepreneur is someone that works within the company, however, can have innovative ideas that can shape the company as well. Uh, I think everyone in my team is actually an entrepreneur because we all have multiple ideas within our little sectors of the company. So what I'm going to do is actually go back to the site and I'm going to say entrepreneur for this. Now, if you'd like to, you can actually go into a lot more detail with this. Obviously, you've got the text box to do so. But for this example, I'm just going to leave it as the one word thing and then move on to the final step. Now, the final step is very simple. It's literally where people can get in touch with you online or, you know, through telephone numbers, email addresses, etc. So uh, all you need to do is list them off and then you're good to go. So I'm going to do that as an example now for you. So obviously they're not my details there, guys, but you know, they're the kind of examples that you'd be adding on, maybe social links, emails, telephone numbers, websites even, all those kind of things if you're wanting to do so. And then once all that's done, all you need to do is hit submit and it'll actually be on that website uh, within kind of 24 hours or so. It does maybe take a while to actually submit and get onto the site. But if you keep refreshing, you should see your uh, actual individual listing on there ready to go. And uh, that's literally all it is to it, guys. So uh, thanks a lot for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and we'll see you guys on the next one.